Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs. It's always my beautiful, growing, soulful family. Thank you so much for the love and support. It is truly, truly appreciated. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, you know, drop a line. I would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And I'm hoping you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And if you, you know, you get it, you know, you feel like the video just give you good vibes or gave you good insight that you truly appreciate, please go ahead and share it with somebody else and maybe, you know, do it just the same for them or even more. It would greatly be appreciated. So I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And um, the content of the video today is going to be Twin Flame 101. Hey, Okas, it will make sense. You know, a lot of times, you know, universe will instill, you know, universe and God will instill in us like a, a vision, um, a, 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 a path they want us to take. And we, we're not sure, you know, just like I was talking on the other video is like during the path of um, uncertainty, you'll, you know, you'll learn to break bread with yourself, you know, and this one, it'll make sense because there's times that, you know, I like if I tried something new, I would get so flustered, especially if I didn't understand it. You know, I'm already placing confusion in there instead of me being open to let me do research. Let me learn. Let me see what this is about. You know, before I start already saying I can't do it, you know, I, you know, especially, you know, when you were a little kids and you had to do something and sometimes they'll get frustrated. And be like, I can't do it. It's like, did you try? I, and it's something I don't know. Uh, you, you know, but you, the question is, did you try? Did you see what it is? You may, you know, you may, you already down it and you never know what it is. You know, I don't even know what it is. Like, How do you know if you don't like it or not? You don't even know what it is. You know, I, I used to hear that a lot growing up. <laughs> you know, I used to hear that a lot growing up. And it's just like. But you're discovering more about yourself. You know, a lot of times, universal lead us in a way, and they don't make sense at times. But if you're not willing to allow yourself to be open, you know, to discover these things, you, there, there may be hidden talents about yourself. There may be hidden gifts that you have about yourself that you didn't learn. There'll be a lot of times that y'all have sent things different, that you know, uh, my way. And you're like, Rosalind, I want to share this with you because a lot of times y'all do that. And I, I say I'm open to sharing. You know, it's like a lot of times that you, I mean, y'all can sit up here and bring me a whole story down of your experience. Like, Rosalind, I'm, you know, I'm sorry for doing that. I mean, how am I going to get to know you? You know, what led you here? You know, there'll be different times. I'm like, dang, this is long. But then I'll discover something about you that I can truly connect with. Or there'll be certain things that you found out about yourself that you're wanting to explore and to see, you know, is this your 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 right avenue? Are you finding people that can really um, connect with what you're going through or what you're experiencing at that time? And, you know, and a lot of times, you know, what we face it does not make sense all the time. And sometimes it don't make sense when we're asking for it to make sense. But it will lead towards some kind of clarity when we're allowing, you know, that opportunity to be open, you know, because a lot of times we stay focused on one exact, you know, what we want in that one exact situation through that choice. You may miss out on a lot of different, you know, things that universe is sitting for you to know about yourself, about your surroundings, about your hidden gifts, your hidden talents and stuff like that. You know, that's why they always tell you get excited about change, you know, um, Make the choices on choosing something you're very like frigid about, you're very scared about because you don't know. You may find something about yourself you get excited about. You know, there's different things that I brought to my channel, you know, that truly excited me. There's certain things that I, I learned about myself I, I did not know until, you know, I found out. Because there'll be certain things like, hey, Rosalind, can you make a video about this? And I'm like, wait a minute, what's that? You know, and it's just like, I, I don't sit up here and say I know everything. I feel like, they were like, Rosalind, you're knowledgeable or you're strong or you're this and this and that. I had to go through that through experience. It's not something, I don't like labels. I just don't, you know. I'm just here. I'm learning off of you as you're learning off of me and vice versa. We're all going through a teacher-student situ situation because there's things that I may know that you may not. And there will be things that you're telling me that, I, that you know I may not. But that's how we're learning. That's how we're networking. You know, we're going through these experiences to be able to learn off of each other, being able to broaden our horizons, as they say, you know, um, and just being able to say, I, it may not make sense to me, but I'm willing to um, willing to learn. You know, when you're allowing yourself to be open, 
you know, to towards different things. You, I mean, you may surprise yourself. And, you know, and there are so many different things I'm learning about myself, and I enjoy that, you know. And being able to see things from a different way, because there's a lot of times I've gotten a lot of comments from y'all. Because you'd be like, Rosalind, I've been going through this and this and this and that, and I didn't understand it. And next thing you know, I was being guided by this video, and it made so much sense. And, you know, and that's why I love my purpose, because there's a lot of things that I may not like you know uh talking about where i may be led to say something i was like dad that's what it is you know and i think i use, i don't know if i use that that meme today or not i think i did i don't know and it remind me of my um boy god rest his soul lafayette from um uh true blood and it'll, it'll say wait a minute you said this person asked me this and i answered that and that's what you were trying to tell me the answer was to my my question the whole time and you're like, oh, that's what that was. <laughs> you know, and you, sometimes you feel this small, like, hey, that's all this is. That was that simple. And sometimes we make a mountain out of a molehill, you know, and we're like, I just don't get it. And it, it, anything that they say that we're looking for is already within. You find that answer within yourself when you're willing to move forward. You know, you're con connecting with other people. You know, um, Sometimes somebody prays for something and then you end up connecting with them like you be in line You know it happens especially when we're in stores. I know it happened to me a lot and Somebody can say something and you just dropping out you, you dropping a whole Easter egg of experience right there We're Like oh, you know because there'll be a lot of people that are starting to wake up now And then they'll say something, you know, and it's just like oh, let me not say that. I said no I totally get it this and this and that and they were like oh for real that's what that is and they'll say something to me I'm like oh for real that's what that is and you connecting with somebody that's just now discovering about that or you you um they've been studying on this for a while and it's just been something that you connected with somebody else for and you know we're dropping easter eggs of of knowledge in that way and it may not make sense at that time but when it's meaning to it will that's what they're telling you you know we always have to be open you know, we have to be open for different things in our world for us to be able to experience, for us to be able to acknowledge. There's just part of yourself that you don't even know exists. You know, there'll be different things that we didn't really know about within ourselves unless we're willing to try. Because a lot of times um, things could become really hard when we're trying to figure everything else on our own. You know, universe is like, you know, come in like, are, are you going to let me help you now? You know, because you've been doing this your whole way, this your whole time, and I'm trying to help you at this point, but you're not trying to allow us to help you. And then when you're like, okay, you know, I'm being open because it's not really making sense. It's like, okay, but we're trying to make it make sense for you, you know. And you're you're understanding that you're learning through all these experiences of different things because a lot of times things can seem cloudy and um, very confusing. When we're when our minds all over the place, you know, if we're focused on things that are not important, not relevant, or you know, it, it could be one way when they're telling us just to bride out, like look in every direction. You're focusing on one, and you know, there'll be times where they're saying you you looking for that answer, and you're gonna find it in different ways, but you're just too focused on right here, right here, and we're telling you, hey, look that way, look that way, look this way, just don't look that way. You know, and a lot of times we're like, it's not making sense. It's like, okay, but broaden the way you see things, you know, be able to understand the bigger picture. And it's all about choice. You know, what we're willing to experience, what we're willing to learn, what we're willing to carry, what we're willing to put down. You know, because a lot of times we got to put something down to pick something up. You know, you can't, some certain things, you know, if you want positivity in life, you have to be able to, you know, let go of the negativity. You know, and then appreciate what that negativity is brought to your life so it can show you where the positive is on that. Because a lot of times, you know, I've talked to many people and it, it, it and it's just like just from that conversation that we can have at that time, it can be very, 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 it, it, it can seem like a whole cluster like, ugh. and then by the time you got the phone with somebody, it'll make so much perfect sense. You know, it's like, it's like, girl, I needed that. Or, man, I needed that. And that's, that's how we're connecting. You know, it, it's making sense through the connections that we're making. That's why I really love my soul family. You know, um, we're all experiencing different things in our lives and it's expanding. You know, there's a lot of people waking up right now. There's a lot of people that have been woke. And they're just trying to find more people that are like them in that age. Because there's a lot of times we'll be around some people that just don't understand us. You know, or there's different things that we see see in a different or a deeper way. 
And some people, you know, there's some people that are closed minded and there are certain things that they, they don't see on the level that we are. And it's also OK, too. You're, you're exploring new um, avenues. You're exploring new levels that are really, um, you know, getting towards your spiritual growth that you truly need it. You know, this is like different things that I'll watch. It, it'll just be like, but matter of fact, just for experience. I mean, uh, for example, you know, like you can have a favorite movie. And, you know, and I always tell people a lot of times you don't realize universe commun really communicates with us through our hobbies, through the things that we like. You know, because sometimes if it's something very negative, like, hey, you need to get you need to get that out. You know, because we're really trying to, you know, we're trying to really learn you on something else different here. But you got to let that one go. But if there's certain hobbies that is, you know, like mine, I love movies. I love, I love watching crime stuff. I love, you know, but now I'm starting to broaden that by watching different things as well, too. About different spiritual, you know, experiences that other people have as well. And then it would be. You can just like music, you you know, there'll be a certain song that you may like and then all of a sudden, you know, be certain songs that you like and then all of a sudden it'll bring up emotion. You may get emotional about it or it'll bring, you know, even it'll be just like anytime somebody says something. Well, not anytime somebody says something I've heard. You know, I said, let me go ahead and retort. Uh, let me go ahead and, re you know, let me go back and say this in, in a different way. There'll be different times that you're consuming what you choose. And a lot of times it's like you're consuming that. It's like, oh, you like that. Oh, that's a part of you. I'm like, what you mean? You know, and it could be something very negative or something very positive. But it'll be just like uh, I would listen to certain songs. Um. And then all of a sudden, it'll bring up a whole emotion. Like, I don't know why I'm crying. I don't know where these emotions is coming from. But then it's just like, it's a message. You know, everything is a message to you. That universe is communicating with us. With They're, they're trying to tell us something. They're trying to get us to see something. They're trying to get us our attention. You know, to make sense of something in our lives. And it'll be just like different songs. And you're really trying to understand it. And it'll be like, wow. You know, there'll be that aha moment. Like, this is what that song was trying to tell me. Like, I, I love Creed. You know, I, I really started liking them when I started hearing them from the Scream uh, soundtrack. Like, what if, uh, what's the other song I like? Um, My Sacrifice or My Last Time Breathing or um, Children Don't Stop Dancing. That, that song really is a tearjerker for me. Or um, Arms Wide Open. That one's a real emotional song for me and I love that one. And it was like when I really, you know, I always look at, you know, music meanings, you know, or the lyrics and it would be just like, wow, you know, this is what that was trying to tell me. Or this is, you know, different things. Because a lot of times people, I'm like, I'm very versatile. You know, these times, like, you know, I, I look, you know, even though the thing is going on with Marilyn Manson, I'm like, look, don't judge me. I'm just loving the music from back in the day. I ain't talking about what happened right now, but I'm talking about back in the day. Because there'll be certain songs I like where he had, this is the new ish, or Tainted Love, or um, what is it, The Dope Show. Um, or uh, Beautiful People. I was like, dang, when he did Beautiful People, I'm like, dang, that was, you know, that's kind of jam. You know, uh, even like the Queen of the Damn soundtrack, especially with my girl Lee on there, God rest her soul. You know, they had a dope, you know, soundtrack towards that. Even The Matrix, you know, different stuff like that. So I'm very versatile with that. And it, it's just like, you know, things speak to you in so many different ways. Because it'll be different. You know, that, like I was just telling y'all the other day, like I love the movie with Holly Berry called The Call. And I was just like, why the heck did I watch this? I'm so woke. But there'll be times where, you know, when they're really getting in character and for them to be able to have an anger like that or have a sadness about that, they go back to a point in their life where it was truly affected that way for it to really look real. And it'll be something that, you know, like, well, why am I watching this? It don't make no sense. And then it'll be something like, hey, you know, this is something I needed in my life that I didn't understand I needed at that time. And it'll be that aha, uh -huh, you know, and it's like anytime, like, I pray for something or I'm in a request or I'm in need for something, you know, God's, you know, God is always there. But they're also, even with the archangels, you know, uh, all our spiritual enforcements, they're there. You know, even especially in detrimental times, they will certainly show up in receipt. But there's a lot of times there's free will. You know, they'll see that, but you have to be open to that. You know, they're always there. They're always there to assist, but a lot of times you have to request that. You know, it's like, hey, I'm frustrated. I'm really trying to understand what is going on. Can you please help me make sense of this? Like, make it make sense. And then next thing you know, it'll be a, a conversation or it'll be a quote. 
or it'll be a video or it'll be a, 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 a trending topic for that day. And it may, you know, you may be needing that clarity for that. But at that time when it's needing to, it will always lead you towards something to make sense for you. So, you know, keep it patient, keep it good, you know, but keep allowing, you know, allow yourself to stay open. You know, to receive that information that you really needed, that vibration or that connection or even that person, you know, and it all makes sense to you when it's when it's ready to. So allow yourself to be open towards that, towards that for yourself. So I hope you were able to resonate with that. I would love to give a personal uh, personal uh, shout out to Derek Tate. Much love to you as well. Uh, Crystal uh, Hardrip, much love to you. Holly Hughes, much love to you as well. If you're new to my channel, welcome. It's so good to have you. Please drop a line. I would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Let me know how you, uh, you know, what, what if you are able to get anything out of the video. Or even if you want me to talk about different topics. You know, I love it when y'all bring new things to me for me to be able to talk about. Now, you know, and if you don't mind, you know, I always give a personal shout out to that person. You know, hey, this person and brought this to me and I would love to talk about this and you know and they were being open to that you know and you just don't know it can open up a whole new door of people you know that really can vibe with that so you know that's really good you know I love that you know our our our, our tribe is really growing and it's nurturing and you know when we can learn off of each other and really you know exchange our experiences is truly blessing you know I really love that so you know I'll leave all my contact information in the description box below it's all about spiritual networking to be able to get Give you a deeper understanding about your purpose or even if you want to share things to me uh things with me not to me but um things with me that you may not understand or there are certain things that you're like hey rosin you ever experienced this before or this is happening you know do you understand this and i'll try my best to be able to to do that you know I, I've, I've always had that situation like Ugh, you know what if i can't you know i don't have an answer but you know like i said it don't make sense but if universe is guiding that towards me or they're guiding that towards that a lot of times it's answering both of our questions that we truly need to know about ourselves as well as our path of purpose so you know it's a good thing about that but i also leave my um my cash app uh, address down there too as well is if you love to make a donation is greatly appreciated as well so i hope you have a blessed safe weekend whatever you are manifesting into your life i'm bringing those beautiful vibes towards you you know for you to receive the most un unexplained unex unexpected you know blessings of abundance that you truly deserve in your life you know a lot of people are really struggling to make ends meet or different things that you're really trying to bring into the light of your your vibrations and you're really trying to understand that you know so don't give up you know a lot of times it may feel like it never is going to happen doesn't mean just because it's a don't think it's denied you know sometimes it's a little bit delayed because there are certain things that they're still in you know in 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 the in the process for you so always trust the process so you know allow yourself to stay persistent and consistent you know if you need a pause for the cause go ahead and do that you know you fall off the horse hey get back on there even stronger just hold hold on to the grips you know hold on to the last so you know how to do that but you never know you know just keep it open to all possibilities because it can be right around the corner it can be at least when you expect it but no it's truly going to happen for you so allowing yourself even through social distancing make sure you give out love light positivity bars five frequencies you never know it can really take somebody a long way and just for you going out your way to do that it can take you even further so I hope you have a blessed safe weekend. I cannot believe it's about to be Friday and it's going to be a weekend already. You know, whatever you're doing, please be safe. Please be responsible. Much love to you. God bless. Namaste. And you'll see me on my next video. Much love. Peace.